bridge represents childhood. I don't know if I see it. That's the only one that... This one is titled The Colors of Home. Wonder what that means? A framed ultrasound. That's not what that is. The, the Eggleston family portrait. All of these are landscapes. Okay, something is wrong with these paintings. These paintings are not what these paintings are. And what the f What is this, Alex? What is it? Ah, he's not gonna even bother misidentifying these ones. Yep, that's the bathroom. We didn't render it, but that's the bathroom. It's a bug. A beetle. Some mushrooms. Okay, that's Alex's room for sure. The latest hit, He Wants It That Way by the Back Alley Boys is playing on the radio. This plaque reads for my little fighter, love mom. Do you think he knows real karate or like fake karate, like from a McDojo? I need to, f I need to find batteries if I want to play this pixelated Game Boy. My father's record player sits on my desk playing music from a better era. It took me seven years to earn my black belt. Is that, is that normal? My mom wouldn't let me bring my games to college, glad I'm home. Now see, I also had a Super Nintendo and a PlayStation growing up, but I was growing up in the early 2000s. Like, that's just what happens when you're too poor to afford a PlayStation 2. You end up with people's hand-me-downs. Alright, so we're supposed to go get groceries. I don't think there's anything of interest in the house. What? Sup? What? That phone call was surely one of the strangest I've ever received. And no, I couldn't hear the music. So, that voice on the phone. Normally, it sounds like it's alternate versions of Michael. That sounded like it was uh, the robot from later in the game. Especially because he said what, and she literally slowed down her audio like a machine would. Okay, now I'm gonna leap. Oh wait, who's this greasy guy? Zine? It looks like Griffin McElroy, but like in a bad timeline. Matt Hawkins. Hey man, you got a second? So, guessing by your physical appearance, I think it's safe to say that you're a fan of video games. Right? Yeah, I am. For five years, I've written about video games and game culture, including art, music, film, and fashion inspired by games and the people who play them. Mostly, I write about t-shirts and jeans, but that's okay. Anyway, a point of frustration I've encountered with my trials as a writer has always been the medium that I used to publish, the print. This used to rock, but now, thanks to that damn internet, it's starting to be too expensive to justify on my own. <laughs> Information is so easy to track down and share. Everyone can be a publisher on the internet. Everyone can have a voice, which is great, but online content is hardly permanent. Neither are books, dude. In fact, books are less permanent. Look at the Library of Alexandria. It's ultimately just ones and zeros. Here one day and gone the next. 99 is just a different beast from 98. The internet is ruining print, and everyone can beat me to anything before I can get it out. This is why I want to create something truly special. Something that isn't about being ahead of times, but capturing them. Something that will be a historical document in the years to come. Oh my god, what a doofus. That really proves how great the 90s were for gaming. And what's a better way to do that than a physical medium? So I'm asking you, gamer to gamer, would you please, please donate some money to me? With your hard-earned dollars and cents, you can help kickstart 90s guys, that's the name of my zine, and get it into stores in the hands of geeks like yourself. I hope the resolution to this guy's story is that he f f uh, is that he founds Kickstarter. Uh, yeah, I'll give him some money. I think I'll get something out of it. Donate five and you'll get the magazine. Donate ten dollars and you'll get a producer credit on the back of the book.
What's the sticker good for? He wants it that way. Single hamburger, mom's letter, collectible pog. Comes the part of Matt Hawkins' soul that I own until the end of time? I have a graphic t-shirt, but I can't equip it. Weird. That might be a bug. That's not normal. What the f This plant looks suspiciously like the Easter Island head. That's what I was thinking. It could use a haircut. Oh. That's an ability I'm gonna get later. I came to visit your mother, but she seems to be working all sorts of odd hours. She works really hard. Be good to her. for looking inside of a trash can. The homelessness problem is solved. Lemonade. <laughs> if you know, you know. Going to the movies with my son. Really got a good feeling about this one. Dad's really excited for this movie. It's just nice spending time together. Okay. Alex is like, I wish I had one of those. Carrying his record like a shield. He looks like the RPG Maker logo. Frankton Maple Street. Southtown. Wait, can I actually get groceries? Is there a grocery store in Southtown? Fixed combat. Two cents? I get more money from the trash can. Uh, there's not a grocery store here. It's three buildings, actually, isn't it? Fighting enemies can be tough, but there are a few tricks that can help keep you safe. Be sure you have the best equipment on. Shops often sell items that'll boost your stats and make you tougher. Shane G. Irving, what's wrong with you? What? What's wrong with you? What's wrong with you? I've been pretty bored lately. I think it'd be nice if something exciting happened for once. Wouldn't you agree? I don't know, kid. I'm buying groceries. We used to live in Frankton, but my mom got sick of the hustle and bustle of the big city. It's not that big of a city. Well, you jump scared. Lovely day for a walk, isn't it? Make sure you take time to explore every area. You never know what great items you'll find. I'm gonna go in your mailbox. Oh, okay. That's why he said that. Smelling salts. Heal thyself. Oh, this is exactly like Hylix. 
somewhere a fan of indie RPGs is like tearing his hair out at that comparison. <laughs> this sign is blank. You can use this phone to save or access the Mind Dungeon. That pizza's groceries, right? Are you out hunting monsters? There are places known as Monsters Dens. Places known as Monster Dens where foes gather. They are great places to train and level up your abilities. Be careful though, some enemies are very powerful. Hey, I need groceries. Do you have groceries? <laughs> Generic water bottle. Name brand water bottle. It's exactly the same, but it costs more. Get it? Uh, if I could just if I could just withdraw another one hundred eighty nine thousand dollars, I could buy this establishment. But the ATM only lets me withdraw one hundred dollars at a time. So is he standing here withdrawing hundred dollar bills until he can buy this place? I got a milkshake, some hamburgers, and a chocolate bar that I found in the trash. I hope that's all she wanted for groceries, because that's what I'm working with. 